This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. school level and we come at you from Jay Savage Court, Towson area, Lawyer Blakefield, we're back again, I've been here since our opener last year, an amazing game against Gerstrap. What a huge, huge BCL matchup here to start the season, two teams that found themselves at Lawyer a year ago in the semi-finals. Now they meet each other today. It was a separate semifinal games. They meet each other in the day in a crucial matchup in the BCL. One and one record for Peretti in the BCL. They're overall five and three, six and four for the Dons. They're trying to stay in that top four race. Swings it back over. Both teams coming off good wins on Friday evening. Swings it back, shot clock at seven. The floater. Inside there, the Smith no good, offensive rebound, back around. Fisher has it now. Cut past the layup goes in for the junior. Early 2 nothing lead for the Dons here at home. And swings them all back here, go ready. McLean, at it briefly. This is the last time we've seen him against Thomas Johnson, but very impressive. Stats. McLean to the lane, and he ties it at two. We're tied at two here. To drive, drives it back one more time. Drive, looking. Nice bounce pass, under, and side blocked away. Here comes the Gales. On the other end, brings it back. Nice pass, one more time, three ball. Hits it. The pain, the singer. And it's an early 5-2 lead here for St. Maria Garrett. Two old BCR rivals here. Last couple of years of Renaissance for both. Back in business. That's inside. Fisher going up. That tipped and miss. Ball under the legs. Still on the deck. Nice hustle by Lawyer. Nice hustle there by Lawyer. And I think the jump ball is going to go right in. It is. Yeah, I better back up one. <laughs> They're on this matinee game, filming it on Sunday, but it is Christmas Day. Thank you so much for joining us here on the Dice Right Network. We have a lot of action here over the last couple days. Rogers pulls up. It hit. Early 
a 7-2 lead. The Reddies, when they're getting their offense, is very fundamentally sound. This. Besides, no good. Ball back. Swings it over. Hunt, back down, McLean. Pull up. That one hits the back. Oh, no good. Two down there to Moore. Moore brings it up. Looks like in the football time. Fakes it. Fisher inside. He went inside and couldn't elevate up. But it got lucky there and the ball went out on Goretti. And the Dons keep it on their end here. My halfway done here in the first. Double header day here on the DSM Sunday DMV. Catholic basketball series at three goals, and it's a two point game. Mount St. Joe's in Common Hall. About 10 minutes away here in Towson. That's coming up after this one. That's a three from Rogers. Top of the key, and it's definitely missed. Yes. And Smith wasn't able to handle it, and it goes on a turnover. BCL Sunday action. <laughs> actually this year from the BCL and I we have a, a double whammy game with Mount St. Joe's Cow Hall. And the WCAC later on in January. Hall six against St. John. Key matchup late January. Right now. Swings it and a foul. A very flowful game as that was the first foul called on either side and this is against the right. Team first foul. Get out to more. Cross and side block from behind by Rogers. And then Rogers was able to grab the ball. American will be enjoying that next year. McLean inside. Big fella Green. And he's shooting too. Two shot foul coming up. What a. Jamie, thank you for checking us out on the Dine Train Network. And who's down and walled off with a DMV tip off? Thank you so much for that action down there. What a joy to see those talented teams. Back there in the Baltimore. That's what Mount St. Joe's come on. Then DMV IC Basketball Showcase. First time at Captain Academy. See them in the surprising Carver Bears to start the season. We'll have that for you. We have the Athletic Show team tomorrow afternoon in the afternoon game. It's out. That layup did not go. Another offensive rebound. That's Walsh is trying to get it up and was not able to. The train back down. Swings over to Rodgers. They swing it one more time. Open three. That hits the back on. No good there. That's Russell. Back the other way. That's a drive. Real six left in the fourth. That was a long distance. Nice follow there by Smith. Hesitates the three, then puts it up, and then no good. Follow with the rebound. Brings it back over to Payne. Payne's got it. The pitch. It was almost, but not able to take advantage. Payne shoots the jumper, and it spins out. That is a blocking foul as Rogers went down hard. And hopefully he's all right. That's called a good box out. Really? It was a good box out. Rogers. Definitely went down hard on that play. Come 
Fisher the senior. First shot. Three point lead. Second shot. Two shots down. Coming down the stretch at the end of the first. Here. Swings it, face the shot, pulls up again, and Rogers comes back in the game. 11 7 game at Fisher. Drives! And a foul, and they call it on Rogers. First shot in there. Two-point two game with 110 left in the quarter. Drive. Swings it. Three ball. That spin down. Offensive rebound by Everett. He threw it a long distance. Bastionovskis was able to chase it down. Rogers pulls up over two guys. Hits the back. Still fighting for the rebound. Staying with Ready. 39.7 left here in the quarter. Swings it back out. Drive floater. Hits the back on. No good. Shot clock and clock about a second and a half apart from each other. Boy can tie the game or take the lead with a three in that court. Swings it. Three ball for the lead and got. As you know, football. They say it was a three. 
At the buzzer! Not there. So after one, the Dons come back and take a one point lead here in this DSN Sunday DMV Catholic High School Basketball Sir. Back with the second quarter coming up here at Lloyd at the Rips. Second quarter here in the way, and it's very sad as court. This is the Lloyd back to the Dons. The Dons up by one. Ball off the foot is a backcourt. Ball goes back to Goretti here. Goretti will be down at the Governor's Challenge. So we can see a lot of teams to Ali. Oh, the slash and tail is Rogers. The lead back to Goretti by one. No good. And tried to get it in the reach in. I was called. Off the inbounds there. Team 12. That's a three. Hits it. Sixteen twelve lead for Garetti. Drive inside. Blocked away. Rogers from deep. Out. It's foul against the That's their 16 foul. One more. They're going to put Lawyer at the line for the one on one bonus. Swain. Four hand it. More for three. No good off the side. It stays with Loya. Brings it to the outside. Back over. Snap. Back. Inside. One more time. Try to dish it in the fishing. No good. Already, good number. Brings it back. That's a drive. One more time. That's a three. That one tips and miss. Over to Johnson. Off Johnson's foot. He turns it over. The other way. Lay up. Looking good offensively. Just already right now, up by six. Timeout by Loyola. That's the Dons. Has not scored yet in the second. And already seven points for Goretti here in the second quarter. Thank you so much. Join us here on the Dice Right Network. Check us out on Instagram and Twitter at Dice Money Network. Of course, always check us out on our official Facebook page, Dice Money Network, and finally the Mother Show right here. On YouTube. Almost 900 subscribers. Thank you so much for that. And uh, checking out Last One Network. On to the best post action here in the metro area. Well, we still got some traveling to do. The Governor's Challenge. Coming up. We have games from there. We have partnership with DMV Elite. Wow. National High School Federations Network as well. Partnership up. 
19 to 12 game here as Garetti's offense has taken center stage here so far. Back over. Out of bounds. Ball stays with Garetti on their end. 22 seconds left on the shot clock. Stats. Inbounds the ball here. Rogers. Going over. One more time. Shot clock at five. Three, missed off the side offensive rebound there. Nice stat. Very nicely done. Turning the basketball, ball back to Lord. 4.54 there left in the half. Rogers, it got blocked there by Stats. He got it, but no. Shot clock at six. Got to do something with it. Puts it up. No good. It did hit the rim. Ball back to Goretti. Four twenty-one left and a half. It's a nineteen-twelve lead for Goretti. That's a three. And that one tipped the lift for the play. Three balls. No good. Out of bounds. Ball back to Granny. 352 left in the half. Get your legs on here. St. Joe's and Allen Hall coming out in the other side of network. It's double header day. Uh, action. We got the showcase when we started that off. We got the double header for you. Side contact the foul. That's a 14 foul against the Dons. This is 340 left here in the first half. Two shot foul coming. First shot. Front end. Cook is coming in again. In the area. We are half posted up on our Twitter. So we'll be down in Wamaco, but we want to see some local up in the Baltimore area. Uh, St. Francis is one, and Calver has one as well. Twenty to twelve game, man. Boy, has been shut out here in the second quarter so far. So trying to get to the line to get some points. First shot. Got it. It's one and one right now. Walsh got a chance to get one more down. Second shot here. Cut the lead to six. And up. Point lead. 20 to 14. The Warriors managed to get 
Back and close. Jumper, no good. Nice rebound there. Fisher. Ball was tapped out of bounds. There was some contact there, but uh, so it's a foul. Fisher. Three minutes left there in the half. Side. Blocked. Back over. Blocked again. Fisher one more time. He's blocked one more time. And this time Rogers drives the ball. Rogers looking to shoot. Why not? And Fisher, the two seniors, going at it. Side off the glass. And in. The lead back to eight again for St. Maria. And a foul. Foul off the ball is going to go against Doretti and it's going to go one one in the back. Here for more. 218 left here in the first half. In there. So we're go down. He's bucket. Boy, still has not scored from the field yet here in the quarter. They have four free throws. Got them within six. Rogers cuts to the basket. Everett trying to get it up and in, and he could not. He got the rebound back though, and a fresh shot clock. As you know, the shot clock's not fresh. It didn't hit the rim. Six, five, four. Shoots it, Cook, and a foul is called. Shot foul coming up here. 149 here left in the half. First shot. Second shot, off the back. the finish. They're fighting for it. It's going to save Loy, I believe, and it will. 133 left, shot clock at 20. Ball 15. Loy is doing this program. What a big win, by the way, against Spalding. That's Fisher coming to shoot. Should be coming to shoot, too. That's a 19 foul against Goretti. Goretti beat Calvert Hall up in Hagerstown. First shot. Second shot. In there. Again. The free throw line has been the friend of the lawyer. Sixteen foul against Lawyer. One more. There'll be a one and one for Doretti for the half. One more foul against Doretti on Lawyer. Lawyer will shoot the two. The rest of the half, that was out of bounds. Stay. Look, Doretti. 
14 on the game clock, 24 seconds left on the shot clock. Drive by Rogers, went out again on Fisher. can make some hay here, let's see. Does, first field goal of the quarter, and it's done by the, the senior freshman. Fisher, excuse me. We are tied. Oh. So we're tied up in the sense of a three-point lead now. No good. That no good. McLean working the boards and got it in. Shot clock, game clock. At about a six second difference. Fisher has it. Garner. Well, Garner can shoot from the outside. Ball was tipped. Shot clock at 13. It's a sophomore wash. Got body to angle, 12.5 here left in the half. First shot. No good. Second shot drops in. Substitution. Four point game. Rogers 10, 9, 8, 7. McLean. Back over to Rogers. Rogers drives. Close it up. No good. Back over is McLean to hustle. Last two buckets been hustle buckets and they have made dividends. So halftime here at Loyola is 27-21. Go right here on the road, up by six. And the, the PWG take with about. We had a second half of here in the park. This DSN Sunday DMV Catholic High School Basketball Series. After this. Second half here at La Jolla underway and Goretti offensively did very well in the corner. Only up 16 points and up by six. It's inside, no good there. From the you know, glass house over, they got it back. And it tipped and missed. One more time, it's stripped under. McLean hustles again. That one rolls off the back. Out of bounds. It's gonna go to La Jolla. No, staying with the ready. 
Could have been an argument for both ends. Both sides touched it pretty close. Toys R Us already gets the advantage over here. McLean brings it back one more time. Pull up. Mystic five. Great foul. And got it in there. That's why I saw he increases the lead to eight. Well, St. Maria Goretti. Where the box, Cam? Turns it over, McLean. Oh. Reverso, no good. Over. All stuck. The section arrow the back. goes back to low. Come on, Karen. Come on. Six fifty left in the third quarter. Don't have the numbers in their favor. McLean back to Rogers. Rogers inside, Mr. Blight. Offensive foul against Goretti. The ball. One back to Loyola. Keep it up. physical play, second team foul against uh, Doretta here in a second. Gary. Second shot. Just off the back, one of two. Here comes Goretti, McLean. Go to Rogers. Inside, no good. Under the legs there. Ball back to Roya again. Seen the travel call call too much. Yeah, no, I believe that's the first one in the game. St. Joe's Calvin Hall coming up. Sunday game B. Got a basketball series here. So much for joining the sport. Place it back, McLean for three. Gets the back on, no good. Offensive of rebound to Everett, but he went off his foot and is going back to Loyola. Coming. 29-22 lead here for Goretti. You know what? I'm gonna make it. Wash. <laughs> Come on, Gab. 
Second shot. You missed that one too. That was the rebound. Now what happens is this. You sit. They swing it around. Second half is that now. Over. Jumper no good there. Pain. Stolen away. Pain. Stepped out. And it's getting the rebound of all stage with the Reading on the Time out by Coach McCray and St. Maria Garetti. His offense right now has been a premium on both sides so far. Both sides have defended well in this game here. This is a full timeout and uh, tell you about the return of the Flex Zone. It's supposed to how you want it when you need it. In January of 2020, the Flex Zone returns here. We're doing all podcast properties as well. It's like some returns and journey. Now we're doing the High School Basketball Showcase at Coppin Academy. We will run down our January schedule here on the Dinosaur Network. And boy, we got some games coming your way. And, uh, our annual basketball academy schedule will be there for day two this year at the basketball academy because we will be for the first time ever going to the girls and do bucket private shop so that's a part of that and then end of january what a run we should have for you in that we're going to talk about that going to in the academy in carver coming up right now we're ready Five seven. Back on the plane. Oh, and he tried to throw it down. Got it back. A shot, tip the miss. Ballas call which way? It's an offensive foul against the Reddit. Listen, works rough call. Over the back all day long. Fourteen foul against the Reddy. And again, that benefits the Warriors. Right now, points. Unlike here on Christmas Day, you got your presents. Yes, they're not giving right now in this one. More. Giants going to baseline, but he's stuck out. Ball back to Goretti with 3.56 left in the, in the third. Biggest lead is now at 11. 
Boy, again on offense. Got to get something going from the field. It has not been pleasant since the first quarter. That's inside. Takes it. Brings it back. That's inside. Tough shot again. And the ball stays with Loya this time. Fisher, got it in there. Got met with some assistance again. Off the screen. Fisher tried to pick it off. He was not able to. That's just giving that one. I tried to pick it off. 220 left here in the third, 20 seconds left in the shot clock. Five pull up. Just a mess. A foul is called against Lawyer. Second team foul. Oh, come on! Down to 15. Jumper. No good effort. Saves it. And it goes in by Green. Time out by Lawyer. It's on. Still down by double figures in for Florida. Now the size difference. It's the physical size difference already. It's making the difference right now. Previewing right now. Next matchup, Mount St. Joe's. We got him against McDonough. Uh, opening in the DMV High School Basketball Showcase. They went down to the Dons over in Orange Mills. But um, since that game, Mount St. Joe's has rebounded. Won a couple. Calvin Hall and Young has took some lumps in this season. They lost to Goretti the other night. And Calvin Hall trying to make a statement game here in the season. They will get Mount St. Joe's, and that's our second game here on the DMV. Catholic High School Basketball Network. We'll take me on Sunday. So we call it the Sunday Series because on Sundays only the Catholic teams in the area play. Take back the game action here, Loya again. It has been tough offensively on the field to get a ball to drop in. It's been real tough. Playing a defense, that's a three! And it hits there for more! Another junior with a huge bucket. They cut the lead to eight. That was a big possession there. They get confidence. Pain. Back. Back. Shoots it. High. Back over that one. Takes the ball and then he puts it in. Eight to ten. Run and miss. Balls everywhere. Moore gets it to Oval Oil. 
seconds left. That's a three. That missed wide. Shot clock is off. Ten point lead here for Gray. The quarter draws nine to the close. We're going into the fourth. Seven, six, five. As Payne got him at the stats. Over. That one no good. The tap will knock out. After three, Goretti's up by 10. 37 to 27, the fourth quarter of this one. Here is coming up. Stay tuned for Fourth quarter here underway. Goretti up by 10. 37 27. The one's down here with you. Here at the Jerry Savage Court here. Premier Sunday DMV Catholic High School Basketball Series. Going the other way. 15 foul against Gretti. It was offensive foul off the ball. Swing it, Payne got it. Foul against Loya off the ball. 13 foul on the Dons. I wasn't sure that whistle worked on that guy. Holy cow. Stay with uh, keep playing. Goretti. Keep playing. Both teams didn't score much in the third. Goretti. Good up 10. Good day. 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 Good Believe defensively in this game, but offensively, not able to take advantage of points on the field. Ball pass there. That's a three. Two bucket. Rolls to sophomore. Hits, and it's a seven point game here. As we're coming down the line here in the fourth. Six, ten left. Pick City. More. 16 foul against Goretti, one more, one and one will be in effect for the Dons, and the line has been the Dons' best friend here in this game, so that, that will prove huge for them. Get it. Swings it. Swings it. Swings it again. Swings it one more time. Rogers. Inside. Big City. Smith. Coast to coast. Land and not get the finish. Call. 17 fouls called. By 
question is, was it two shots or one? First shot. No Sundays with BCL, MIAA, and WCAC action. Names we're looking forward to John Kell and Mount St. Joe in the beginning of 2020. John Kell and St. Francis will have them on the Sunday series as well. St. John's, and the gentleman, all six St. John's series, and February before focus on championship play. Hopefully, we'll be Fisher, do the basket count. First shot. Oh, yeah. Lead down to five as we win the one on one bonus. Second shot. Got it. Five minutes left in this one. Lead to four. Of the great, of the dons right now. That's a three. Spins out. Foul against Sloya. Fourteen foul. Gives it up to McLean. McLean inside, fade away, and it plank goes home. 39 33 game. This is a 10 day show. 4 30 left in this one. Side, no good. Rogers smashes the rebound. Back over to McLean. McLean carried the basketball. Ball back to Lord. 4 15 left. Then Nico. Then Nico went to play. Mitch, take that guy down low. Get him out of here. Moore, over inside. 
Brings it. That's a three. Yeah. Two buckets. That one is a three-point game. Fifty yeah. left in this It's all about going down hard, McLean plus it on the side there, he went down pretty hard. Got yeah. away from that. There. Yeah. 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 Clean, he'll be all right. Some ice. Something there as we turn from that. 3.38 left. We'll be back with you in 30 seconds. Back here, playing on the road with the half dog. Look at him, he hope he's all right. Right now for Garetti, crucial possession. No good for Rogers. That went to fly back to the oil. Three twenty-four left. Scored two points here in the quarter themselves. And now offensively, they have to get things back and going. And without McLean, they can create a shot. Inside, that was piled. That's no good. Pino tried to save it, he could not. Lawyer can take the lead for the first time since the end of the first quarter. And The Greyhounds up one, 40 to 39. Close one again. Here to Jerry Savage court. That's a try, that's a pull up. No good. Offensive rebound. Foul is called. Foul is called there. 16 foul. One more foul. Against Loyola, we'll put Gretti in the one on one. One more foul on Gretti. From Gretti against Loyola, that's a three. No good. That'll put Loyola in the double. It's huge right now. Bringing it up here is more. Two minutes left. Swings it.
Push out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Need to four. We come here, Lord. Don Rasavis. Wings it to Rasavis. Off the knee, out of bounds. It's going to stay. Session here for the ready. Payne inside the Rogers. Hook shot. Missed off the back again. What we got? Offensive foul. Had fouled out. McLean had to leave because he unfortunately got cut on the floor. That's Goretti's two. That's offensive weapons and lawyer defensively. A couple clutch buckets offensively. Getting the job done. 122 left. And the lead is to six. Timeout. Three point lead, 108 left. A good game to open up the Sunday DMV Capital League Series here. How about that? And Mount St. Joe's Capital Hall coming up. Back to game action here. He back. McLean walks back in the building. He's looking to come back in the game. He's able to banish that. They're going to let him in. Like, yeah. He's defensive possession here for Goretti. And Fisher has it. Gives it up to Moore. Down the stretch we come. Session here for uh, you know, Ken. The he hit this. Front end miss. Rebound. Yeah. 
Fisher for Moore. Timeout by the way. Shot clock ain't about seven second difference between the two. See, we're gonna have down a stretch here. This one, like we said, coming up. Here after this one. The Mount St. Joe's and Calvin Hall. <laughs> Hopefully they get a call right. Back to game action here. Ready, should have took I'm a time. I'm just over here cheering for my team. You stay over there cheering for your team. And a foul. 2.4 left, two shots. You hit one, that'll be the ball. Let's go, Nick! Yeah! Lawyer. Watch win here. Ready, fought. Second shot. Yeah, Both of them go. Substitution. 2.9 left, a five point lead. Not enough time. Really do much. We call a quick timeout. 2.9 left. And we will be. Calvert Hall and Mount St. Joe's to come. We're getting the beginning of that game. We'll be able to put them on the line. You know? They're going to 
Yeah. 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 McLean flips it up. Front end miss, that's the game. 40 some point two is the final. Here we go, Seven four. Ready will drop. Two. Oh, wow. Five points for Goretti in the fourth quarter. Five quarter. Five quarter. Five quarter. Five quarter. Kind of time them difference in the game. Mount St. Joe's Cowboy Hall is second game coming up here on Christmas Day. Going to live stream network. Stay tuned for it. This is Die Sporting Network.